Uh, could you tell me what brought you out here today? Um, well, I'm in Denver to protest the Democratic National Convention. You know, the uh, Democrat Party platform has a provision that says we should punish employers who hire undocumented workers. What are your thoughts on that? More marching. Uh, absolutely not. You know, I'm, I like, as I said, I'm for, you know, a world without borders. I mean, I think we're all, I think, you know, I welcome immigrants in this country. I think it's great that they can. I think there needs to be more. You know, I'm, I'm an internationalist, not a nationalist. You know what I mean? Why, why do you think this system attracts immigrants? Well, I mean, let's look, let's look at this honestly. We have the fact that the, the world capitalist system has actually crushed the economy in Mexico, where people used to be, be able to live with self-sustaining uh, farms and agriculture. Now it's been all switched over to uh, coffee to sell in the international market. So when the price of coffee crashes, the whole economy crashes along with that. So people have to come here in order to look just for ways to work, just to survive. Now in the past, in uh, communist countries, generally people have tried to move out of the country and not move in. I think that um, it's very difficult to be good on immigrant issues without also being good on, on trade issues. We, if we think of immigrants as sometimes as economic refugees, then we have to start also in analyzing how are our trade agreements undermining economies elsewhere. Now I saw on the Democrat platform there's a provision that we should crack down on employers who hire undocumented workers. Uh, what are your thoughts on that? Well, absolutely. That was, that's what was supposed to happen in 1986 when the law was passed back then, but uh, no one enforced the law. And President Bush decided to enforce it basically the last 12 months. But he had uh, seven years to enforce the law, and he didn't do it. He also had seven years, almost eight years, to pass comprehensive immigration reform, and he didn't do it either. So there's been a massive failure on the part of President Bush, and that's why we now have states and cities and local communities passing laws that are very unjust, and in many cases, very punitive against undocumented workers, and that's why we need a reform at the federal level. Now I saw on the Democrat Party platform they say we should uh, crack down on employers who hire undocumented workers. Uh, what are your thoughts on that? I mean generally I believe that if you want to deal with this, if you think this is a supply problem, the way that you deal with the supply problem is always with the demand. However, I think sometimes when we talk about employer sanctions, uh, we go to the extreme and we end up hurting the workers we're looking to protect. So it has to be a much more balanced approach. And the devil's always in the details and those haven't been hammered out yet. So you, I mean, you are not supportive of like the raids that are going on at different uh, businesses around the country? Um, generally not, because they only serve one purpose, which is to terrorize, in my opinion, and it also splits up families.